people have seen me uh, take and cut trees down and put all the limbs in the ditch. That's the crew that picks it up. That's pretty good service to have. Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West Channel. Today I want to prove to you once again what a powerful fire maker this Wallet Fresnel lens is. Let's go ahead and feather up one of the hardest woods on the planet, dogwood, and I'll show you how to solar ignite it. Now let me show you the quick way to process this branch of dogwood. I don't really have the technique down yet because these should have already come, a, come out batoned in half. So let's try it again. That's more like it. All right, let's set up our log cabin fire lay in the three quart stainless hobo stove. Bark is always questionable tender, but I'm going to put it down beside the fire lay. All right, I'm making feathers now, but our tinder bundle that we're going to solar ignite is going to be shavings on the bottom, feathers in the middle, and then scrapings directly on top of that. I've got such a weird angle because I'm trying to keep the camera out of the sun because it won't take long before it overheats and cuts off. These scrapings right here are the magic. You've got to have scrapings for this to work. So I'll bunch that up into as tight a ball as possible, add it to my feathers and shavings, and see if we can get this ignited. Here's my feathers and shavings. This is going to be to feed the amber once I put it into the hobo stove. And you always want to wear shades when doing solar experiments. I guess you can see that. There's the scrapings. Put these ridges towards the sun. And this isn't the best sun. The best sun is over here. Yeah, that's more like it.
Don't blow on it too soon, it'll just cool it off and you'll have to start all over again. It's a very easy mistake to make. Give it a couple of minutes to build up a big enough coal before you give it a try. Build that coal as big as you possibly can before you stick it in the hobo stove. Alright y'all, do me a favor, before you leave my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and in that drop down list, select all, and do give the video a like. I uh, appreciate you joining me on this one, we'll catch you on the next one. I'm going to reset that camera to where there will be a dark background. So you can actually see the progress that the fire is making. Hold on. That's more like it.